In this question, here you have to determine the pair of compounds which can exist together. That means they can't reaction with each other. Now, if you see the first option here, the iron presents with its highest oxidation state plus 3 and which can go its lowest oxidation state Fe plus 2. That means here reduction occur. On the other hand, in SnCl2, Sn presents with its lowest oxidation state plus 2 and which can go its highest oxidation state plus 4. That means here oxidation occur. Now, if you consider these two compound FeCl3 and SnCl2, where FeCl3 undergo reduction, on the other hand, SnCl2 undergo oxidation. That means they react with each other and can't exist together. Okay. Now, if you see the option B, here also the mercury presents with its uh, highest oxidation state plus 2 and which can go its lowest oxidation state Ag plus 1. That means here also reduction occur. On the other hand, in SnCl2, where Sn presents its lowest oxidation state plus 2 and which can go its highest oxidation state plus 4, that means here also oxidation occur. That means here AgCl2 and SnCl2 are react with each other, so they can't exist together. Now, if you see the third option, here iron presents with its oxidation state plus 2 and it can undergo oxidation and go its highest oxidation state plus 3 and the SnCl2, it also presents with its lowest oxidation state plus 2 and which can undergo oxidation and go can undergo oxidation and go its highest oxidation state plus 4. That means here FeCl2 and SnCl2 both can undergo oxidation. So, they can't react with each other. That means they can exist together without any reaction. That means here the right answer is option C.